tight as we can, keeping our shoulder blades tight, torso tight, abs tight. We're just bending at the hips, slight bend in the knees. We're going to be throwing that kettlebell out. All this kettlebell is, is just, it's attached to the arms. You're not using any upper body to pull the weight up. We're using all hips. So get that in your mind right now with the kettlebell swing. It's all hips. So right here, get yourself set up. Now what I like to do is get a little bit behind the bell so we can hike it right into position, snap right out instead of picking it up and having to bump it out. I set myself up about a foot or so behind the bell so I can just drag it into position. So I start by sitting my hips back, chest up, drag it into position, snap it. Now I'm using hip drive. Boom, keep your chest up, snapping it, arms are staying straight, using hip drive. Now, what we don't want to do is overextend. That's another mistake I see a lot of people make with the swing, as they use hip drive, but they overextend, they're arching too much on their back. All we simply want to do is come up straight, squeeze our butt, weights back on the heels, Boom, straight up and down, using hip drive, just like a uh, deadlift. As soon as we get past our knees, snap the hips forward, squeeze the butt, straight line. We don't want to go any further than that. Keeping the abs tight. So again, pull it into place, snap straight up. Boom. Just let that up, fall right into place, snap it right up. We're coming about high level. Coming about high level. Okay? There's some different variations where you can go all the way overhead. We're just going high level. Now, once you have mastered that, we can go single arm swing. Same thing. Now we're just loaded up, up on one side. So you can check this out from the front. Again, I'm going to get set up a little bit behind the kettlebell. Hips back first. Pull it into place. Snap it up. Boom. Try to keep yourself balanced out as much as you can. Right there, we can switch sides. Boom, you can do alternating. Just remember, using the hips. So that's your basic kettlebell swing right there. Okay, so work on using your hips, keeping the weight back on your heels, all hip drive. Not using the upper body, don't round the upper back, stay tight, use those hips. So, Again, I'm Travis Stentil, bags, bells, and bodyweight.com. This is part one, kettlebell swings. Check out the other parts, parts two, three, on different variations of swings. Check it out.